Hello friends, Techman Pat here. I hope you are well. I'm actually sleep deprived because it is technically a form of torture, but that's because my beautiful daughter was born about 12 days ago. Or was it 13? In any case, I can't really count days, but I, what I can count on is some really cool news out of the IT and telco world. In this case, NBN has announced that they are getting their two gigabit speeds on. That's right, folks, two gigabit, 2000 megabits a second could be coming soon to the fiber to the premises and HFC network at your home. So let's talk about it and let me pop this bubble and this party because there are some caveats for you folks out there on the HFC network. Make sure to like and subscribe. Let me know your thoughts below about this announcement. Let's get into the details of it right after the intro. As always, we're screen sharing. This is the NBN Co announcement. It's official the 16th of May. NBN Co accelerates multi gigabit speed talks with retailers. We can have a quick read, but the gist of it is that they sent out a message to all the RSPs asking, hey, let's talk about more speeds. But the RSPs in fact said, hey, let's talk about it but let's talk about it a little bit earlier. Let's talk about it now because they are really keen to be able to sell these speeds. And that is both for residential and commercial. So what are we actually gonna be getting? Well, the NBN Home Hyperfast for fiber to the premises will be offering speeds of 2000 megabits per second down and 200 megabits per second up. Very, very interesting. And I like the fact that it's more than 100 up. Now the NBN Home Hyperfast for HFC is also offering speeds of up to 2000 megabits down, which is two gigabits of course, but only 100 megabits up due to the limitation of that copper. But I wanna talk about another limitation that I found in my research for this video. And business fiber plans on the fiber only offering speeds of 2000 megabits down and an eye-watering 500 megabits up. This is really, really cool, but obviously limited to those folks who have an ABN and are willing to spend the dosh on that. Now, there is one thing that I'm gonna break it up to you right now. There is no way at the moment that you can get this speed on your current fiber to the premises modem and your HFC modem. They're just limited. The ports in your modem right now are limited to one gigabit a second. So if we have a look at our guide here, we can actually see that this port right here, and I'll scroll down, the Uni D port is actually only a one gigabit port because if we go to the specifications, it does say it is a one gigabit port. Of course, on the announcement, they do say this right here. As an essential requirement to enable multi-gigabit speeds, a new slimline single port NDT, which has the technical capability to accommodate future speeds of up to 2.5 gigabits per second is proposed to be made available for residential use. And a new four port model, which has the technical capability to accommodate future speeds of up to 10 gigabits per second is proposed for businesses. Now. You could take the Tesla approach and reduce how many modems you have out there and just have all modems either do 10 gig on one or 10 gig on four just to not mess about and future proof it a little bit. But this is the NBN, not much we can expect from them. Now, there is also a limitation I wanna talk about on the HFC network, the hybrid fiber coaxial technology. Now this of course means that you will be using a copper cable from the node near your street. Now this copper cable is shielded, it's thicker, it can get higher speeds. Right now on the NBN, you can get one gigabit. Most of the time it's been at about 750 megabits per second. However, recently the NBN announced that they'll be unlocking that and you can get the full one gigabits per second. Now they're saying that you can get two gigabits per second. However, uh, during my research for this video, I found somebody did a spectrum analysis on their NBN hybrid fiber coaxial cable. And this was back in 2020. I will link this page below. It's really interesting. This site is amazing. Tech Zone for Dr. Coffs, I think. Anyway, Dr. Co here did an extensive amount of research and testing about the HFC cable and found that the capability speed that this can achieve is about 1.4 gigabits per second or 1,400 megabits per second. So you will not be getting the new speed on HFC. You'll only be getting about 500 megabits per second more, potentially paying a lot more. 
The thing is the DOCSIS uh, 3.1 can actually theoretically achieve 10 gigabits per second on HFC. So a little bit more context on that. DOCSIS 3.1 can only achieve 1.5 gigabits per second on HFC if you want to keep that 100 megabits upload at 100 megabits. If you go more on the download side, your upload will go even lower. So in the US, Comcast customers who have HFC or cable, that is actually their maximum 1.5 gigabits per second. That's what they are being offered right now. Furthermore, if NBN upgrades to DOCSIS 4.0, they can technically achieve two gigabits down and 100 up. And that's really, what I know so far. And time, you may have seen the lawn tail name gently kicked around on this channel a few times, but I finally made the swap. My NBN connection is now serviced by lawn tail and I'm going to happily recommend it to you. I've been absolutely stoked with the performance thus far. So if you're looking for a very flexible, fast, low ping for all that gaming goodness NBN supplier with great customer service and not one of the big players who see you as a number, then check out lawn tail. Use the code techmanpat below to sign up and you'll get a $25 credit on your account. And your NBN connection will be swapped within a few hours with absolutely no hassle. Lawntail is flexible with no lock in contracts with plenty of features for the techie folks out there. So check the links below. Thanks and back to the video. So there you have it folks. Two gigabit plans are coming soon. They're gonna cost an arm and a leg, but this is massive. We've had so many great announcements recently of Australia catching up with the rest of the world. I don't know what videos are gonna be making about the NBN once they're doing 10 gigs everywhere. Maybe I'll be talking about the amount of ads that are gonna be shown, or maybe we'll have some <laughs> FCC issues like with net neutrality. It's gonna be exciting and I'm really looking forward to reporting on it. Friends, thank you very much for watching. Make sure to subscribe to see more content like this and of course support this channel. And if you smash the like button, it lets me know that it's worthwhile making these videos even if I haven't slept for the last 20 hours. I'll catch you all in another one. Bye.